Okay, what's going on, guys? We're going to uh, rock the FF6. That's what we are going to do. Alright, back to Vector. Back to Vector. Some pretty inconsequential battles right here. It's just, you know, making our way there. Uh, the battles are pretty easy. You know, we did a lot of grinding in this area, so... Please talk to as many as you can before dinner. Make them understand. 
This is like a little mission to try to talk to as many as you can. You have four minutes until dinner. Please talk to as many soldiers as you can. Okay. Talking to them, they count. I don't, maybe. I don't know. Don't worry about uh, what they're actually saying. Just uh, talk to as many as you can. Big circle here. Sure, we'll take some treasure. Okay, there's two of them from here. Three of them from here. And goddamn. Oh, this guy wants to fight me apparently. Having that little quick to get into the, the fight here. There we go. Another fight, okay. We're clearing this room out at least. So that room, I'm pretty confident we, we finished, so... Continuing... Get out of my way, guy. wants to fight me. Holy. I mean, we're doing pretty good. I just think like we're gonna run out of time here. Seconds getting stuck on the corner there. Twenty four soldiers. That's pretty good. You get a reward based on how many you talk to, so I'm pretty confident twenty four is a pretty good reward. This way, please. <laughs> I'll sit with the returners, if that's alright. At last, we can all be together, sharing a meal at the same table. Let us make a toast. To what shall we raise our glasses? To our homelands. Well then, to our homelands. 
may know, I have imprisoned Kefka for his crime of using poison against Dolma. What do you think should be done with him? Let's leave him in jail. I see. Well, let's let him stew in his cell for a while. Then we can decide what to do. I am truly sorry about what occurred in Dolma. No one ever dreamed Kefka would use poison. Terribly sorry about what was done. I promised to punish Kefka severely and to work to eradicate poisons all over the world. By the way, with regard to General Celeste, Celeste is one of us. Kefka was lying. General Celeste realized the lunacy of this war long before I did and went over to your side. Was there anything else you wanted to ask? Why do you want peace now? Because I now believe that working together is our only hope. With your permission, I'd like to move on to discuss the Espers. Okay. The Empire has been decimated by the Espers that emerged from the sealed gate. They're just too powerful. If we don't do something, they'll tear the entire world apart. You're the one who brought them here in the first place. When the Espers came through on their rampage, all of my ambitions faded in an instant. Now I find myself asking why I ever wanted that much power in the first place. Of course, there's no excuse for the atrocities I committed in the name of conquest. By the way, what was that first question you asked me a minute ago? Right, anyway, I truly desire peace. I want you to understand that. You must be getting tired. Why don't we take a short break? That was, that was like two minutes. Keep talking. Is there anything else you wish to hear me say? I wish it was a no, but... Now your war is truly over. Alright, I swear here and now there will be no more fighting. And now I have a favor to ask. After they attacked us, the Espers flew off northward towards the Crescent Island. We have no way of knowing when they'll decide to go on another rampage. We need to find them and convince them to set aside their aggression before that happens. But, considering all that the Empire has done to them, I doubt they'll be willing to listen to us. That's why, that's why I need to borrow Terra's power. Terra is the only one who can bridge the gap between human and Esper. I have a Magitech armored transport ship in the port of all I had hoped to send it to Crescent Island with all haste. Would you please go on board? Yeah, we kind of have to. I'll have my top general and some of his troops accompany you as well. General Leo! I'm General Leo. Pleased to make your acquaintance. Didn't I see that guy in Doma? Alright, he was the one with the principal. So, that's General Leo, eh? Isn't that black? Retainer to the King of Doma. Please forgive me for not being what happened was not your fault. I'll be waiting for you in Albrook. Please, find the Espers and convince them to cease their attacks. You're our only hope. I didn't really want to use lock. Alright, we gotta use lock. Well, I think I just used lock and Terra. Yeah, it's a little tough, but... Right, you be careful too. Sorry, I skipped some of that reading. That was more thinking. Yeah, that I just have these two. Has any. Okay. Yeah, go with something like that. That'll help. So, we're gonna need some uh, sprint shoes so we can move fast. Where's those? Where's those? Sprint shoes. Maybe, uh, 
I will give him uh, Hermes sandals as well. Actually, do I have? Uh, let's get Vanish going right there. Alright, we're off to Albrook. Well, here's the item we get from talking to the soldiers. I bear a message from the Emperor. Due to your decorum at tonight's banquet and your grace in speaking to our soldiers beforehand, the Emperor has decided upon the following. All Imperial troops will be withdrawn from South Rugaro immediately. In addition, Imperial forces will be withdrawn from the Kingdom of Doma. We also unlock the armory at the Imperial Observation Post to the east. You are welcome to any of the weapons and armor within. And this is a personal gift from the Emperor. Obtained, uh, Titania Bulum. That's a word. Well then, if you excuse me. Where is There it is. Titania Bulum. Relic restores HP with each step taken. Gives you no other benefits. It's not a bad thing. Alright, off we go. shops here or anything? Or the pub. Ha, ah, Gale's in the pub. Smells like cider. Smells like old man. That is, that is awesome. He's just sitting here by himself. Just chilling. Just taking it in. Oh, we got some Narsh troops here even? Oh, there is a weapon or uh, an armor shop. Not really providing us anything we need there. Never know.
inn is just up here. Oop, that's not the inn. That's the relic shop. General Leo already made arrangements for your stay here tonight. By all means. It's not a very nice sleep. They're awoken, aren't they? Yeah. Left the door open. What are you doing, Locke? Celeste. Please, why won't you talk to me? I know, I doubted you, if only for a moment, but... We can still be friends, right? Celeste! Okay, well, that was kind of sad, wasn't it? Celeste wasn't much for words there, was she? Right! Off we are, then! Alright, let's go! It's a pretty story-heavy chapter. So Crescent Island's all the way over there on the right side in the middle. It's kind of like Newfoundland-shaped. You know what that island is? The engines are all running smoothly, sir. We should arrive tomorrow morning. Why don't you rest until then? Having trouble sleeping? I hear your emotions have returned. It's strange, isn't it? The Empire used me, controlled my very thoughts, and now here I am, cooperating with the same people. People are people. Not everyone in the Empire is like Kefka. So, what about you? I know that you were half Esper and being made to suffer through horrible experiments, yet, yet I did nothing. I'm no better than Kefka. If a human and an Esper can love one another, do you think a human and I could love each other? Of course! But, I don't even know what it feels like to love someone. still young. Someday you'll know it. I'm sure of it. But, I want to know now. I got no patience. I want to know now. Who's there? I thought I'd sleep out under the stars. Did you hear what we were talking about? I didn't mean to listen in. So, I can't help you. Those are answers you'll have to find for yourself. Tara. There are people in this world who have chosen to kill their own Remember that. Ugh. Oh. Ugh. Blah! Yeah, 
Yeah, so Locke's getting seasick. He didn't figure out what's going on there. Shadow's just like, yeah, I, I want no part of this. Uh, world's greatest treasure hunter. Reduced to this. Blah! Uh, you can figure it out from there. I'm not gonna make vomit sounds for you. Off to Final Fantasy VI Newfoundland. to Crescent Island, when we make landfall, we'll split into two groups. I'll go with Celeste. Terra, you go with Locke and Shadow. If you find any clues as to where the Espers may be hiding, report back at once. Let's go. Shadow! Woof. Um, Locke, I, um... Come on. Locke's like, yeah, no, not having any part of this. See you, Celeste. You ignored me last night. So let's go ahead and equip up Shadow here. I like that. Increases the chance of preemptive strikes. Don't need two people with, uh... Don't need two people that have the, uh, sprint shoot, so... Give him some healing magic. So I believe the town up here is called Thamasa. Buy anything from the shops here. People here like don't want anything to do with you. So yeah. What brings you folks to see me? This is Strago, an elderly gentleman who has spent his whole life pursuing the secrets of monsters. Espers, eh? Hmm, haven't heard that word in years. So you know about Espers? Nope, can't say I do. Don't know a thing. Not one thing. Something's fishy here. Grandpa! Now this is a character I'm gonna rename. Hey! What do you think you're doing, young missy? In her picture, she captures everything. Force, water, light. The very essence of things she paints. So I usually call here her. I usually call her Ilsa. Yep. I-L-S-A, Ilsa. Yep. Grandpa? Who are they? Are they friends? Can they use magic too? Shush! What a cute doggy. Back off, he bites. Go back to your room. Why do I have to go to my room? You never let me have any fun. Because I said so. Now shoot. Fine. Hold on one second, guys. I got like a hair in my eye.
one too. That was bothering me for a while. Oh dear, seems like you have t seems to have taken a liking to your dog. Huh. That child. My apologies. It's fine. He usually doesn't like other people, though. Anyhow, I'm terribly sorry, but I can't. But I really don't think I can be of any help to you. I, uh, I see. We're just your ordinary, quiet little village. You're not gonna find anyone who knows about any of those escort things here. I'm afraid. Not in Thamasa. There's something strange about this place. Let's have a look around the village. Thanks for your time. Sorry I couldn't be more helpful. Interceptor! Bye bye Stay the night at the village inn. Okay. One gill per night. I think we can arrange that. You gotta help. Ilsa, she's... There's something happening to Ilsa? Yes, she was on fire. And then it caught the neighbor's house on fire. And, oh, I can't even think straight anymore, but please, you have to help her. Shadow. Interceptor, where did you go? Yeah, he's more concerned about his dog. Ilsa's in there. Alright, we're gonna have to get her, guys. Ilsa! What are you doing? Flames be gone! Mayor, magic is forbidden. Magic? I don't care. Ilsa's inside. Flames be gone! Mayor! Alright. We have no choice. Stand back! Flames be gone! Not really working, guys. It's no use. The fire's too strong. They were storing an awful lot of flame rods in there. I don't know what that is. Or, like, anyway, I'm going in. Wait, I'll go with you. Count me in too. I'm not going to let an old geezer in there. Go in there on his own. <laughs> Who are you calling in geezer? I'm only 70 and fit as a fiddle. Geezer, he says. Quickly! Alright. Let's give him, like... Oh, let's give him that, maybe. Higher defense with the white cape? Sure. Sounds good. Let's give him, uh... Yeah, you can have Shiva. That's good for inside here, I think, right? The fire's spreading fast. It looks like this house could collapse at any second. We have to hurry and find Ilsa. Yeah, we do.
I gotta take that off. Okay, so gotta remove that, uh, slave tongue. Learn self-destruct. Yeah, like... Strago's got lore, which is like an enemy skill. So yeah, you just got self-destruct. Um... Yeah, sorry. Equip, lock, flame tongue, and heck no. Assassin's dagger will do just fine. Okay. Yeah, that's better. Can't have locked uh, healing. treasure in that other room.
ice rod. Let's make sure we're fully healed there. Do I want an ice rod? Nah, nah. Well, nah, okay, it might be good to try for this battle. Is this what started the blaze? Flames off, dog. Fighting flames with weapons. Love it. Only in Final Fantasy. Time to get out of here. I'll use a smoke bomb. That makes sense. Are you okay? Yeah, thanks, Grandpa. These folks are the ones you should be thanking. Thank you. I guess our little secret is out now. Everyone in this village can use magic, can't they? What is this place? This is the village of the Magi. A long, long time ago, humans used magic sites to acquire magical powers. 
who's who gained the ability to use magic were the people known as the Magi. I didn't think there were any Magi left in the world. After the War of the Magi, the Meskers, the Espers, fled to a new world beyond the Sealed Gate. They wished to live in peace without the fear of their powers being used by others. That left only humans in this world, and the ordinary ones feared the Magi's powers. Was still fresh in their minds. It was soon turned into an inquisition. Magi were hunted down and executed. Oh, there were trials, of course, but they were merely for show. Even though, even though the only difference was that they could use magic, the few who managed to escape took up shelter here. They were our ancestors. Our powers have been weakened as our Magi blood has thin, but they remain in some form or another. If you're up to it, do you think you'd be willing to help us? You said you're looking for some escorts, right? Well, I do owe you one for saving Elsa. I'll help you find your escorts. I want to go too. I think not, young lady. Fuddy duddy. But, where do we start? Hmm. If they came this way, they might be hiding in the mountains to the west. Why there? Those mountains are teeming with magical energy. According to legend, they're a sacred place to the Espers. Perhaps the magic of that place drew them there after they went berserk. It's worth a look. save guys cool we'll uh we'll see you next time hey what's going on guys i hope you enjoyed that make sure you hit that like button and hit subscribe if you want to follow more